Hey everybody, it's Rory from ANS Gear. We're going to take a look at the Jackhammer 2 LPRs today. Um, if you aren't familiar with autocockers, this might be something new to you, but if you've uh, dealt with cockers, um, then this is probably something you're very, very familiar with. So basically what a Jackhammer 2 is, uh, is just a fancy word for a regulator. Okay, this is a second stage low pressure regulator. Um, it's going to take your pressure coming in that's already been regulated by your first stage regulator and regulate it down even lower. In this particular gun, uh, this is one of my older autocockers here, my Jackhammer 2 or my regulator sits right up here. It's going to always be in this basic position on most autocockers. Um, so the pressure coming from my regulator down here is going to come up into my Jackhammer and then my Jackhammer is going to lower it down to the working pressure for my solenoid. Now if you don't have a solenoid or an electronic autococker, you're going to have a three-way here. It's going to do the same thing though, regulate the pressure going into the three-way. Now what the three-way does, or my electronic solenoid here, is it controls the pressure going into my ram assembly, which makes my block move back and forth. Now in this particular gun, if the pressure going into my solenoid was too high, then I would ruin my solenoid. And if I ran the same pressure coming out of my, my first stage regulator straight into my solenoid, I'd have a problem. So that's what this does. By adjusting this knob at the front right here, I can increase or decrease the amount of pressure coming through and into my solenoid or three-way, making the gun work properly. Um, you can use too much or too little. Basically, you just want to, you know, you need to properly set the gun up to make sure that your LPR is running at the right pressure. But that's what it does. So if you have a, um, like an original WGP gun that has a, um, a LPR on it, but doesn't have a knob on the outside, some way to easily adjust from the outside, this is going to be a super, super handy tool for you to have. To be able to control the pressure in your LPR, it makes it much easier to work on. On the older LPRs on a lot of the WGP guns, you had to disassemble the regulator to adjust it. They had an internal screw that was only accessible by taking the LPR apart. And that's kind of a pain. So these ones here, you can adjust them from the outside, increase or decrease, makes it super easy. They're available through the website. Order yours now through ansgear.com.